Pages can be daring, confusing, and very expensive. But today we'll be talking about cages, what you should buy, and what you shouldn't buy. Do you even need a cage? How big should a cage be? And can you make one? So, do you even need one? If you plan to let your furry friend roam about in a room all to themselves, then you might not need that big of a cage. So for example, if you plan to let your carpet shark run around and roam as they see fit, then they'll only need a small little cage or cave for them to sleep in. That way, they can go to sleep in a safe, secure little spot when they feel like it. Cat snakes enjoy having a hideaway, a cave or something for whenever they want to have a siesta. They prefer to be in a tube or a dark place, just anywhere where they can feel secure. For example, our cage here isn't meant for them to stay in, maybe for short trips to a veterinarian. But the thing is, they have this whole entire room to themselves. They can roam about as they see fit. And this cage is actually fairly big. It's never closed and it's got two hammocks and a second level. And so for them just to sleep in, this cage is perfect because they have access to the whole entire room. By the way, it might look like my room isn't a really big mess, and it is because I'm rearranging things. Eventually it'll look a lot better than it is, but for right now it's just a mess. Synchronized eating. Both at the same time. Rosie, for some reason, just likes to eat on top of the cage. I guess it works for them. If you don't want your fuzz bunts to roam about, terrorizing the blinds, dogs, and plants, then you'll need a cage appropriate for a ferret. This is the ideal cage for a ferret. Room to move around, explore. A single stage ferret nation cage could work. Nevertheless, ferret math can creep up on you. So it might be a good idea to go ahead and get the expansive one. Here's some examples of cages you don't want to get. On Craigslist, you'll see a few bird cages labeled as ferret friendly and it'll look similar to a ferret nation cage. However, keep in mind though, a bird cage is not a ferret cage, and to convert one to be applicable to a ferret would be a lot of effort and potentially harmful if done incorrectly. Pro tip though, don't search ferret on Craigslist. You'll want to save the ones you see. If I don't sound myself, it's because I just received news that the show I work on, The Morning Show, which is my main source of income, over half my income, it will end at the end of this month. So there's only a couple of shows left, and naturally I'm kind of bummed about that. But I suppose all good things must come to an end, so... Yeah. Hey guys, I'm thinking of doing a Steve Harrington cosplay from Stranger Things. Hopefully you think the same, because if you do, I'll keep the hair for a little longer so I can do the cosplay. Any cage made with chicken wire or some cross sidebar, whatever that is called, is not a good idea. It invariably will be climbed upon by your weasel friend and escaped from, so not a good idea. Now, what could possibly be wrong with something like this? As it turns out, carpet sharks can climb and or fit through those small spaces. How might you ask that we know? 
We've tried them. And now a bunny has that enclosure. This one is deceptive. They have an eight-week-old ferret in there, and it's still too small for an eight-week-old ferret. Full-grown and baby ferrets would hate living in that cage for more than a second. And this one, the open wire design, I, I don't see that being anything good for a ferret. Now, how big should the cage be? I would use the one single stage ferret nation cage as your basis for any cage. Just be aware that a lot of cages won't be suitable for a ferret. And if you can't find anything that's suitable for a ferret for less than the cost of a ferret nation cage, you might want to start dying. I mean, DIYing. More supporting life. I need more life. More life. More lights. Lights. Okay. We need more light. Okay. Releasing the Kraken. <laughs> Why, hello, babies. Hey, hey. Hey, what you babies up to? Hey. Hi. Come on out, baby. So, can you make one? Absolutely. In fact, it can be a fun family event if your family is up to the DIY craze. Most DIY cages you'll find online will be for rats. A couple of changes will be required to make a cage suitable for a ferret, as a ferret is not a rodent and has very different needs. Let me know if you want me to make a video on how to DIY build your own cage. But it is absolutely possible to do it for much cheaper than a ferret nation cage if you're willing to put in the effort.
Ladies and gentlemen, I'm on level 10 because I have ferrets and they've got the merits to steal all your things with great precision. Not to worry, you just need a prescription to ferrets weekly, it'll all be peachy. As the first rhyme of my new EP, my new mixtape, it's gonna be lit. Lit when it drops. Ferrets. Thug life.